winning again, no, it would be great. But no, I mean, obviously, anytime you know you open up a tournament, I think it's important, you know, not to lose. You know, so I look at it a little conservative by from both teams, you know, and I think that the game will probably be a draw. But I think it's a group that, uh, uh, in the end of it, Greece, I think has a, has a good chance to to advance and go through. And talk about opening up against Poland, and then also plays the Czech Republic. Have you called up Peter Novak, Roman Kosetsky, Lubos about, about uh, these games coming? Yeah, we have some side bets going on, you know, but. Uh, you know, I mean, I was there a couple of years ago when I knew that, you know, things were going uh, uh, underway and preparing and, you know, I think just building some of the new stadiums or just making them better. And I, and it was exciting, you know, so I think for, for Poland, Ukraine, I think, you know, for this day to finally come, it's going to be huge. I know they're going to have, uh, you know, a lot of support. And then obviously it's always exciting to be open and, you know, to have an opportunity to open against uh, one of the host countries. You know, I think there's... It's going to be, uh, look, fantastic. It'll be a good game, but I think always the first games, I think both teams want to be conservative. They'll push at a certain moment, but nobody wants to start the first game with a loss in a tournament that uh, like this. So, you know, Czech Republic, you know, Lubos, uh, it's good because he's a little bit too old and he's not playing, so I think that's good for Greece. But, uh, no, the tough matches, but I think it's a group that Greece can advance. So where do you, where, they won in 2004, where do you see them? I mean, you never know. I think it's, you know, I think they go through in a group and then in single elimination games, anything can happen. And a lot of times in those matches, you know, it's not always about the best team, but the best team in the day and things go your way. You, you, you never know. But I think they have some good, good young players and some good players now that are playing uh, abroad in Europe. They're coming in with, with a different mentality and a good, you know, good experience, uh, good experiences. And I think so. I think it'll, they'll, they'll be a strong team. Solid always. Uh, from a defensive standpoint, and uh, but they do have some some weapons going forward.